you know, we're going to start off with our great St. Patty's Day celebration yes. here with a place that I just absolutely love. Deliciously different candies. Becky Knapp is here joining us. She's all St. Patrick's Day ready to go with uh, I see the canal mud, but we're not making she even brought her green nails for us today. I see the canal mud. We're going to chomp on that a little bit later. That but what are you good. making for us today? I'm actually making it's called an Irish potato candy. It's not from Ireland and it has no potatoes in it. Okay. <laughs> so where we get the so name from? I have no idea where that came up. It actually started in Philly. In Philly? Mm hmm. Hmm. Mm -hmm. In okay. Philly. So I'm going to go ahead and start because we're going to actually make it while we're here. Okay. So. This is just a package of cream cheese, and you want to soften it. Okay, and then see. this is equivalent to one stick of butter. It was soft when I left the house. Hey, things change, trust yes. me. And all you're going to do is beat this. Wait a minute, I got to <laughs> You got to pull, pull it out. out. Yeah. <laughs> Let me climb up Keep here. Keep going, it's yes. okay, you're good. Anyways, just beat it together. Add in some vanilla with it. No, doing this by hand would not be fun. No, no, no. <laughs> you definitely, you would get a good workout on your arm. Yeah, that but would that's be a good thing. It. And it will be up real quick if your butter is a little softer than mine. After that, once this is in, then you want to start. This you want to do a little bit slower because you'll get a big puffy cloud of. Here we go. Whew. Yeah. It oh, really is. look at you, the expert here. Yeah, yeah. We'll wait till I'm done. <laughs> It actually really does beat up pretty quick. Once your powdered sugar is all in, you can see how it's incorporating pretty good. And once it's in, you can go a little bit faster. And I don't know if they can not see. Not worried it gets, about. Can we, ah, it gets nice that and creamy. shot might be able to get you. I was gonna say it gets pretty good and creamy. We'll put a little bit more in, and then I'm gonna just. Is this the secret recipe as far as how oh, it goes? No. Okay, no. so we'll, we'll put it on our website yeah. so everyone think, can make uh, some of this. I think Stacy has it. All right, great. So they can put it on, it's really easy. There was four cups of powdered sugar and after you would have all of it incorporated, I'm not gonna incorporate all of it because it takes a little bit of time, but after well, you're done with that. We get the idea of what yes. you're doing here. Now what after do we have you're here? That's what you're gonna, you put coconut in it. That's and, coconut. Mm. Well, Actually, my first batch, I did the coconut just like it was out of the bag, mm -hmm. and it was just a little too stringy. That's what's actually in that over there. You can see there's a lot more texture to it. Oh, okay. So, so, so I you're just, saying don't eat those because those. No, are no, they're oh, still okay. good. <laughs> but I wanted to try it both ways to see which I like better. Okay. So there's one way, and this is. After that, you're going to just start putting your coconut in, and when you put this in, got the glove on the wrong hand. You need to basically do it by hand. I know, I'm sorry. Oh, you need to just stick the hand in there and get you at it. You basically are going to knead it in until. Now, it's very, very sticky. You're going to think you'll never be able to do anything with it. But as you get everything in, and if, if you get to the point where all of this is in and it's still too sticky, you can go ahead and just add more powdered sugar. It's not an okay. exact oh, recipe. So make it even sweeter. Yes. That's fine with me. Then, after this is all incorporated. It is messy. You do need oh, the it's, gloves. Yeah, it's very messy. If this was all in, would be a little different. Okay. But Just once it's all incorporated, <laughs> I'm going to have you dust them when we're done. Oh, we're going to dust too? Mm-hmm. I love their place. It's right in Canal Fulton. I'm telling you, that, is, that was one of my favorite road shows Oops. that we ever did with New Day. It is such a quaint little town. You're right on the main drag there. There's so much to do. It's a great place to go and spend a day. Yeah. Okay, and so we're... We're done, it's all nice and chilled? Yes, you definitely want to chill it. And while you're working with it, you actually want to chill it if it starts to get soft or you will not get it off your hands. Oh, okay. So all you're gonna do, you see now how it's much easier? Mm -hmm. You're just gonna pinch it off and you can either roll it. I did some in round and some in long because I was thinking Idaho potatoes and then I thought, well, you know, there are other kind of potatoes too, Could which you? I forgot about. <laughs> So I thought, okay, I can actually make some round ones too, because round is much easier. Ooh, and they, they're nice and they're not that firm, oh, no, so no. they're just gonna melt in your mouth. You can put them in the fridge. Because they have so much cream cheese, you don't want to leave them out for days at a time, obviously. Okay. Keep them chilled Keep until you're ready to serve them. You okay. can do All this. You can do is drop it in. Yeah. You can wiggle it around like this. Oh, that's it. And then if you use a fork to take it out, it'll let the extra, um, coating come off. The what coating, is this again that we have? Okay. The coating is actually cinnamon. Cinnamon, okay. But I use a very strong cinnamon. I use um, 
Vietnamese cinnamon. It's much stronger because I love cinnamon flavor. So you do you sell these in the store? No. No, but they do, you do sell the canal mud. Yes, I do sell the canal mud. Actually, we're going to be giving out those. Whoever comes in today, we'll have a bunch of it made up to just hand out for St. Patrick's Day. Awesome. But well, if you don't like cinnamon, you can add powdered sugar to cut the cinnamon flavor a little bit. Um, you can do it. Some people do it in cocoa powder and powdered sugar together. So you can do it some different ways. So a variety ways. of different ways. I'm going to let you make a few more. Okay. okay, and while you're making, mm -hmm. I'm going to talk about a brand new trend that is for men right here in Cleveland, Ohio. We're talking kilts for the guys. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> so, we Jessica, how do you think we did? We do okay? You, did a, you guys, they look awesome. I'm, do you want to pick one that you would like yes, to try? Yes, I, I do, and you have to let me know how I eat it. Do we eat it in one bite, or do sure, we? Sure, why not? I'll take the one that I stabbed several times here. You're not going to be wearing, <laughs> hopefully, exactly. cinnamon. Becky be taught us a little trick here, What's saying trick? that you just take the, the fork once you've coated it. Yeah. Shake the and you thing. And you tap mm -hmm. it underneath because too much cinnamon will mm. make you choke. Will make you choke. I, mean, we don't, we, I don't <laughs> want to make anybody choke here. Mm. D are you okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, she's fine. Should it's I so wait good. to eat? <laughs> like because I'm nervous now, I'm not gonna be able to eat this down. <laughs> they're so good. Honestly, they're Thank wonderful, you. delicious. Check them out in Canal Fulton, right along the main drag mm -hmm. there. Canal Street. In Canal Fulton on Canal ask, Street. Ask for some of the mud with when canal you go. Mud. For oh, sure. Delicious. Thanks so much for being here. Oh, you're here. welcome. I love it. All right, it. you can talk and I'll uh, <laughs> They're good. Enjoy turn. that. Enjoy okay. that. Silicon on New Day Cleveland, the truth behind some of oh. the hottest ingestible beauty products. And we'll be right back after the break.